is 7 o'clock in the morning. Good morning. And uh, it's time for me to get up for the day. Alrighty, well I've gotten all ready and now it's just a matter of waiting until my mom is ready and editing a video. I'm not going to get this video up until relatively late with the schedule that we have packed today. Our cleaning lady is here and uh... It's time for us to get out of here. I think I might have just edited the entire video in like 50 minutes. I guess that's not too unreasonable, but still got it all done. It's not super long again, but uh, yeah, that's fantastic. I'm going to get that all set up so that all I have to do is upload when I get back. He's not in his room. Check exercise room. As you just heard, my mom is reading off some stuff about my grandpa because we're gonna go visit him first of all I, are we going shopping first yeah a little bit we're gonna shop around a little bit in Fort Wayne then we're gonna go visit him then we're going to go to Serva to see the people that I used to work with and she used to work with also I made close friends with a lot of them so I want to make sure that I'm Still seeing them and kind of maintaining a relationship because they're good people. Gonna go do that, and then I've got my hair cut at three. Well, I'm gonna get all of them cut, all my hairs. And then we're gonna go work clothes shopping. And then we're gonna go work clothes shopping because I only have like three pairs of slacks, and I figure I should probably have five pairs of slacks. <laughs> I think that's about right. Yes. Alrighty, so I ended up getting to export the video in the time that it took to get to the place that we are starting shopping at. So that's good. We're going into a little place called Big Lots. A little place called Big Lots. What is that called? That's a... Is that an oxymoron? Oxymoron. There we go. That's what I was trying to think of. Oxymoron. Good job, Mom. Look at you go. I'm definitely going to leave that clip out. <laughs> I'm just going to skip to the part where I say oxymoron. Yeah, yeah, that's it. <laughs> just kidding. This, uh, this couch is very nice. Are your pillows gone? The pillows she wanted. They're gone. <sighs> These will look good in the sunroom? Oh, they'll look fantastic. Should I go jumping from couch to couch? To Test them all out? Nope. Nope. Okay. <laughs> so, my mom's thinking about going into Tuesday morning. I don't think that they're open though, because it's... Well, it's Wednesday morning, right? <laughs> Alrighty, going in to see my grandpa. And got him some, uh... Frosties from Wendy's. Because, uh, he likes them. Does he know that we're showing up? Yeah. Not in his room. Check exercise. Not always, but they just come home with his lunch bucket, you know. They, they used to care. They have candy bars in there for us. So I remember that. <laughs> and he'd put it, his face would be black and be dark late at night when he got home around 5 o'clock. Huh? He'd put his face up against the mirror or the window. The <laughs> nose <laughs> Joking around with you? Yeah, playing his cows. Funny. How old were you when he died? Five. Aww. I wonder what death was like, you know. Man, you just have the, the body in the funeral in your home, man. Oh yeah. And I went down there in the middle of the night. I remember the feeling to see what it was like. Cold and hard. <laughs> Didn't scare you though, huh? No. Yeah. I just turned around and thought, I'm so the bed. <laughs> One time he came home and she lit in there and he says, Go to hell, Mom. Oh. <laughs> Next morning he sobered up and he came downstairs and says, Mom, you have to go to hell for the long term. <laughs> <laughs> well, he was all right, but what happened when he was about 10 or 10 or 11, they had a tonsil operation. 
Okay. And they cut the main nerve in his throat. From that time on, he stuttered. And he stuttered so badly, and then he chew his tongue. Aww. And um, they laughed at him at school, and one of his mom took him out of school. It was great because the kids were making fun of him, she didn't like that. Yeah. Yeah. So she took him out of school. So he never had a formal education, he never passed eighth grade. That's awful. Yeah, I know. And that was all from because of the t tonsil ectomy or whatever? From the surgery? Yeah, my cut his brain never in the throat. Oh and my she, goodness. She stuttered, you know, he stuttered. So when did he pass away? Uh, he was 29 years old and he passed away in 1940. Unfortunately, my camera died right in the middle of my grandpa's storytelling, but I uh, got, got at least a couple good ones on there, so I'm glad to have captured that so that, you know, I have those kind of memories of my grandpa's family around forever. So we are heading to, heading to go get some food, my mother and I, and then we're going to head over to service. Look at that. It was like a Hummer fire truck. Did you see that? I did. Have you ever seen that before? I have not. I'm hungry. Are you hungry? I'm starving. Alrighty, so we are heading into Serva now. Heading in to go meet up and say hi to the friends that I've made over the past few summers. I'm not going to film in there because that's uh, crossing a little bit of a boundary. <laughs> Alrighty, well we just left uh, Serva and it was really good to talk with everyone in the best way possible. I wish that I didn't have this internship so that I could just spend another year with them because they're just great people, so fun to be around, especially uh, Pat who I've worked with for three summers now. It's just so good to see him. Uh, He's just a good guy. Right, Mom? Yes, he's the best. He is the best. Well, we're gonna go shopping around a little bit before my haircut, get my haircut, and then shop around some more. Woohoo! This is her kind of day. It's a pretty blue fountain. What's that one? Oh, is that a cowbell? <laughs> more cowbell. <laughs> <laughs> That's a cozy. More cowbell. No. <laughs> I don't know how it works. This is before. This is before. <laughs> I don't know how short I'm gonna get it, but decently short. Alrighty, well, got it all cut up. It is nice and short and it feels all buzzed in the back so you can like feel the hair going against you know what you know what I'm saying mom? You ever like rub your hair against the grain oh, yeah. of you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. It feels like buttons when he gets his hair cut. Thanks mom. <laughs> anyway, I uh, got it all cut. It's good and now we're heading to go do some shopping to make me look professional. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look, look at that. There's Bummer poor people. Mm -hmm. Oh, that is a big old dookie. Sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Alrighty, we're going to go into Glenbrook and do some shopping around for some clothes for moi. She's probably going to shop too. Ah! Wow. Sideswipe by a... Mom? I don't really have anything to say. I just... Here we are. On Here an we escalator. are. Here we are on an escalator. Uh, might be getting some stuff from Express. Maybe. Maybe. These shirts look so form fitted, and like you're when you're buying them, you're gonna be like, "Ooh, these are fitted so nicely." Look at the back of them. They're completely like pinned up. 
complete unrealistic expectation of what this shirt is going to fit like. All right, well, after a very long bout of shopping, we are finally done. Oh, here you go. And so we ended up getting two shirts, two pairs of pants, and four socks, four pairs of socks. Uh, ended up spending a lot of money, but that's what you got to do. Alrighty, so the only thing that I have left to get, and I say only loosely, is I've got to get some new shoes, and if I'm going to fit the code of dressing up, then the belt has to fit the shoes, so I might have to go find a light brown colored belt. Alrighty, so we're just getting back home, and... We got some Taco Bell because we're gonna be really healthy. <laughs> but we're gonna go to the gym in, I don't know, maybe a couple hours. Once I've eaten and I've kind of had a bit to chill, then I'm gonna get myself back up and go to the gym. Are you going, Mom? Not sure. <laughs> <laughs> Just sitting here getting the video up and watching YouTube videos while I wait for it to get all uploaded. Look who's outside of my window again. Well, we walked off pretty quickly, but Jasper was out there. He's a, he's a wild kitty. Alrighty, well, I got the video up, which I'm happy about. I'm glad that that is done. One other thing that I'm happy about. Got her addicted to Game of Thrones. Very nice. How are you liking it, Mom? It's good. Alrighty, well, it is about 9 o'clock now, and I am going to be heading to the gym really quickly just to get in a quick arm workout. I've got to make this one kind of quick because the gym closes at 10. So by the time I get in there and I'm all set up, it'll probably be 9... 9 10 and then I've only got about 45 minutes to work out so I've got to make this one a bit quicker than normal but that will be fine because I won't have my mom or anyone else distracting me I'll just be focused focused alrighty I'm heading back to the house now it is about 9 50 so worked out for maybe 40 minutes or so but have a pretty big brisk pace so I'm happy with the workout going to uh, going to head back and try and get to bed at a decent time I want to try and get my body started to be used to uh, waking up so early so I might just keep myself up at 7 tomorrow and just keep that habit up so I'm gonna try and get back and get to bed at a decent time tonight alrighty well it is about 11 o'clock now and I have bought more clothing <laughs> well not necessarily clothing I bought the shoes that I've been thinking about buying for a while um, so it's been a big spending day but it's all stuff to get get me all ready and set up for the uh, for the summer so needed to get that so I got that and I have a few more things that I'd like to get at some point but I think I have enough inventory to last me at least until like you know, at least for a few couple, for the first couple weeks, and then once I get a paycheck, and I, that I might spend some of it on uh, additional clothing. But anyway, it is eleven o'clock. As I said, I was gonna try and get up at seven. That's probably not gonna happen. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, but I will try and get up relatively early. So, with that being said, I'm going to leave you off here end this here so thank you so much for watching and i will see you tomorrow it's gonna be sad because victoria won't be there usually when i'm at ball state she's there with me working legs but uh but i'll be with you but you won't be working legs with me yeah. Yeah. i'm probably gonna keep like the same style of hair just shorter especially in the back oh no I'm sorry.
don't know. I feel like it looks, does it look like a little bit, uh, I can't, I, I don't know for sure what that looks like. <laughs> I can't see the back of my head often.